myself Anina. I'm here to talk about the ethical issue faced in Nestle company. The Nestle company history begins in 1866 with the foundation of the Anglosis Condensed Milk Company. Henry Nestle develops a breakthrough baby food in 1867 and in 1905. His company merges with Anglosis to form what we know as the Nestle Group. Nestle has faced various ethical issues over the years. But one of the most notable is the controversy surrounding its marketing and sales of infant formula in developing countries. In the 1970s and 1980s, Nestle was accused of aggressively promoting infant formula to mothers in developing countries. Despite the fact that many of these mothers lacked the access to clean water or could not afford buy the formula. The promotion of infant formula led to decline in breastfeeding rates and an increased infant mortality rates due to malnutrition and waterborne disease. Nestle was accused of violating the World Health Organization International Code of Marketing of Breast Milk Substitutes, which regulates the marketing and sales of infant formula to protect the health and well-being of infant and young children. The ethical concerns raised by the Nestle infant formula controversy include the responsibility of companies to respect and promote public health and the need of companies to adhere to ethical marketing and sales practices, especially in vulnerable populations. The controversy also highlighted the importance of government regulation and international guidelines to prevent the exploitation of vulnerable communities. In response to the controversy, Nestle committed to implementing the International Code of Marketing of Breast Milk Substitutes and establishing a global policy on the marketing of infant formula. The company also implemented various initiatives to promote breastfeeding and improve access to clean water in developing countries. However, the controversy has continued to haunt Nestle. With ongoing uh, criticism from activists and advocates who accuse the uh, company of not uh, doing enough to address the harm caused by its past actions. The issue remains a reminder of the need for companies to prioritize ethical consideration in their operations and respect the health and well-being of all stakeholders.